Micron is uh, 22 nucleotide RNAs, which are ribonucleotides. And just by way of introduction, if you take our genome, which is essentially the complete set of our uh, 23, uh, you know, 46 chromosomes, 23 pairs, and you, uh, break it down, they are made of what are called nucleotides, and you can think of them like letters in an alphabet. And it turns out that our entire genome that, you know, brings about this amazing complexity in biology from songbird to, you know, monkey to us, it's written in a four-letter alphabet. So basically it's A's and C's and G's and T's, and these are nucleotides happening in different combinations, and that's what our genetic code is. And for the lo longest time, we were focusing on what are called genes, and the definition of genes as we knew it then is that a stretch of DNA, a stretch of nucleotides, it could be 500 nucleotides or letters, it could be 5 million nucleotides or letters. Genes come in different flavors and different sizes. Um, they are transcribed or expressed into RNA, which is an exact copy of it in the RNA form. These are ribonucleotide letters, the same letters, just a little bit different. And then they are translated into what are called amino acids. Once again, these are letters, but a different kind that are stitched together to make proteins. They, the proteins then fold on themselves, making, make these fascinating shapes, and they have fascinating functions and um, you know, roles in our body, which go on to do everything that is needed to you know, make a you know, complete human being and do all the wonderful things we do.